Hi everyone, Liz here, thanks for stopping by. So I've got a parcel to unwrap today and this parcel has come to me from DIYChoose.com and um, they contacted me and asked if I would like to show some products on my channel and I said yes of course. So let's get into this and have a look and see what we've got. We have one diamond painting, two diamond paintings and three diamond paintings. Okay. So there are a few special offers on at the moment. I think you can see what this one is. <laughs> well, maybe you can't, but you can see a little face bobbing out there. Um, if you buy four, you do get one free at the moment. So if you've been a winning iron about whether to get three or four, you can now get four because you get one free. Um, there's free shipping over $39. And there is also for a limited time only, it says on the website, as I'm making this video, at 5% off. So, yay, bargains all round. Obviously, just go and check uh, for your country and on the day that you're doing your order as to what the special offers are. But there just seems to be some really, really good ones on this minute. So, and I love a bargain, so hope you do too. Right, let's get into this one and have a look. And I just thought this was so different. Well, very different for me anyway, not something I've seen before. Uh, it is a special drill. So, yep, yeah, it's Lizzie's special drill corner. <laughs> okay, we have one of our little basic starter toolkits, pen, butt and wax. We have lots of lovely blingy drills in there. Oh, with some specials as well. And it is Grasshopper. And I just thought, well, I have never seen one of those before. And I do like to try and get things that are a little bit different. And I do like my special drills. There's quite a few in this series. I think there's lady beds and other things as well. I just thought, oh, he's quite sweet. I quite like that. And he's not going to be very green, is he? The backgrounds are lovely green. But there's going to be lots and lots of different colours on him. And they are quite big as well when you see them. Um, I know we went abroad somewhere on holiday and one sort of like landed um, on the uh, balcony. And I just looked and I said, I didn't realise grasshoppers were that big. I don't think they're quite that big in this country, but the one we saw was about that big. And he was lovely and he just sat there for ages. So I just had a little chat with him. You know, he wasn't very chatty back, but. You know, probably thought, who's this mad woman? I know he's Spanish anyway, so he wouldn't be able to understand what I was saying. <laughs> anyway, let's have a look at this canvas a little bit closer. So we have 14 different gems and colours. The so set is a special drill and it is a partial, which means that none of the greenish background is actually uh, covered in gems. So you don't need to dye and paint that. You are just love doing this lovely grasshopper. And he's, he's really sweet. I just really liked it. Um, it possibly will go on the wall at some point. As you know, I've got my magnetic frames that I swap things in and out of. So he may go up for a while. I don't think he'll be up permanently. Uh, and it may stra seem a strange thing to have on the wall. But there are a lot stranger things you can have on your walls. <laughs> Okay, so it says he's a 30 by 40, but I think we'll find that we're a little bit less than that. So, yeah, we are 25 centimetres, nine and three quarter inches by uh, roughly 35 centimetres, which is about 13 and three quarter inches. So, just a rough guide, just to give you an idea. But I do like that size because I do like to have a little bit of frame around my paintings most times when I'm putting them into a frame. Uh, and these do fit in those magnetic frames. They are sort of like made to fit these canvases. So that's really, really good. OK, well, let's have a look at the gems and see what we got. Just move him up a bit so you can see all of him. Don't worry, he's not going to jump out and kind of scare you. <laughs> Okay, let's have a look. I said 14 different ones. So we'll start at the clears first. Nice, lovely, bright clear drills there. And a little palish pink there. We've got a nice cherry red. 
and a lovely grassy green. You've got to have grass for grasshopper. And a nice goldy yellow. A nice sky blue. Oh, a lovely royal purple. Oh, and look at that one. A nice, uh, very orange. Uh, orange. <laughs> and a little bit deeper red. And there's no hot pink in this one. Don't tell me I've managed to. Oh, yes, there is. I've just seen one. <laughs> I was going to say, don't tell me I've managed to get a special drill canvas without a hot pink in. But I've just spotted one. So we've got some larger rounds uh, that I've got the facets on and they're like a goldy, pearlish gold colour. But yeah, we've got a hot pink and it's your little marquees in hot pink. Yay! Oh, we've got to have hot pink. <laughs> uh, we've got some large uh, blue, sort of sea blue. And then we've got the teardrops. Yep, the teardrops in a nice grassy green again. And a little bit rounder green. So the green seems to be sort of the one that's got the most colours. We've got three all the same colour there. Well, not quite. No, that one's a bit darker. But those two are the same colour. <laughs> okay. But that is going to look lovely when it's done. Uh, the next drills and shells is going to be... I think it's January next year. So not quite as long to wait, but... I may get some of these done before then because I don't like uh, just if I've had a stressful day I find that coming home and just doing a special drill canvas just really does relax me because um, you get the whole thing finished at once so you think well I've had a bad day but at least I've accomplished completing a diamond painting <laughs> well that's me anyway <laughs> okay so that is project number one Let's have a look at the next one. Shall we have a look at this one that's in the packet? Let's see what we've got that's in the packet. Okay, I can't remember what this one is. Uh, oh, the price of that one was £4.58. And, oh yes, I think I do know what this one is. Let me just oh, get into it. Oh yes. Let's see, let's see. Oh yes, this one's a full drill. And it is a 30 by 40. And I just thought this was a little bit sort of quirky, a little bit different. Okay, it is coming up to that time of year again for Christmas. And crafters do need to think about Christmas that little bit earlier, because if you're wanting to get all your projects completed, then you do need to get them a little bit earlier. Unless you're very organised and have everything planned out, because I just don't. <laughs> okay, pen, boat and wax, same again. Oh, and these are all in your little drip seal bags, which is excellent. And they're all numbered. Do they have the DMC codes on? They do. They've got the DMC codes on as well. Oh, nice colours. Okay, and this one, I just thought, how cool is that? Um, I have relatives who live in Australia and I have quite a few uh, a few YouTube friends now that are in Australia as well. So I thought, well, when you have your Christmas, it's your summer. So, yeah, what's better than a pair of flip flops, uh, which is what we call them, flip flops, um, with holly on. <laughs> and I just thought the colours were great. You've got like your candy cane design around the edges we've got some sweets here look like your little um, boiled sweets that are like christmasy sweets a little starfish another little round boiled sweet there but i just thought the flip flops with the holly berry on was just brilliant and merry christmas so yay just for our friends that are in hotter climes when it's uh, the coldest weather for us and it's christmas for us <laughs> i must admit when uh, my niece always sends me photographs of her little family with uh, Father Christmas um, and they're like on a beach <laughs> and it just looks so strange to me seeing Father Christmas on a beach but maybe uh, to people in hotter climes seeing uh, Father Christmas in snow is maybe different <laughs> but yeah I just thought oh I love that and I love the colours I thought yeah that's a definite canvas I'm gonna have to have I may even do it and send it to my niece in Australia. 
and uh, not try and think about how much it will cost to send. <laughs> I know the Christmas cards last year were just ridiculous for postage prices. I think just to send a birthday card, it's something like five pounds nearly. Um, so yeah, it's, uh, the postage has just really, really gone up, along with everything else, I suppose. But uh, but she's worth it. And uh, she will get a surprise if she sees that. And hopefully it'll make her laugh and smile as well. Because it made me smile when I saw it. And it looks like it's all little holly berries, doesn't it? On the uh, flip-flops on the base. But yay! Really love that one. And the cost of that one was only £3.80. So great price. Um, I don't think I'm going to take these out because... I think we can see all the colours. There's 17 different colours on it. We have got DMC codes. It is all numbers and letters. So we've got reds and greens and a little bit of pink thrown in there and a nice winter white there as well. And I think that's practically every Christmas colour you can think of there. A little bit of burgundy just thrown in as well. But uh, yeah, we've got one, two, three four different shades of red and we have got a hot pink what can i say i've got another canvas with a hot pink it's a little bit paler than a hot pink but i'm calling hot pink <laughs> okay as i say it is full drill that is a lovely clear drill field those letters are just about popping off the screen okay let's give it a quick measure but i think we'll find that we're about 25 by 35 just double check just in case anybody wants to know and yes we are 25 nine and three quarter inches by 35 13 and three quarter inches i do like the fact that the edging is all diamond painted as well um you know you've got like your candy cane effect all the way around the edge in your red and actually you know this isn't all one color this is a lot of confetti. We've got a few C's along there and then we've got threes and a few E's and twos and fours and sixes mixed in. So it's uh, not all background, it's all the same colour. There's a few different ones. So if you like colour blocking, uh, it's maybe not quite for you. There's quite a little bit of confetti on that one. But I just love the colours and I just, it made me smile. And that's what it's all about. So, yay! That's number two. Okay, and I love the fact that it's all come in your little grip seal bags. I mean, if you want to work from your bags, you could literally just get on and do that one now. Okay. Well, if I can pass it through the screen to you, you can have it now anyway. <laughs> and the final one is a Christmassy one too. A one too. <laughs> one as well. <laughs> Okay, let's get this one open and have a look. Okay, so our same toolkit, pen, butt and wax. This is all crystals. Ooh, look at those. There's some lovely greens in there. Gorgeous. And this one is, I've seen this one for quite a while and I thought I'm just going to have to have it. It is so pretty. And it is a Christmas dress made out of Christmas tree stood on your like um dummy your dressmaker's dummy yeah that'll do dressmaker's dummy okay there's not a lot to diamond paint on this one so it will be quite a quick project to do uh, it has got a white background but actually on this picture i don't mind the white background because i think with it being christmassy and all that gold and the little bit of red it's going to stand out better on a white background if you put that on a different background, it may not just have quite the impact. So I like that one on the white background. Okay, we have 13 different gems and colours on this one. And I have actually seen one of these Christmas tree dresses. Um, a few years back, we went to, I think it was Burton Constable Hall. And they had, um, on the entrance to their little shop and cafe, they had one of these dresses um, in the entranceway that somebody had made. Very clever. There's some very, very clever people out there. Very talented. 
which is real effective. Okay. Right, there are no drills on the writing, which actually, with it being such um, a fancy font, <laughs> Uh, cursive writing I think if you put drills on there they wouldn't really show up but you could always get like um, an iridescent glitter glue that would just go over the top and just make that sparkle a little bit more uh, without actually uh, detracting from the writing from the letter but I think that is really pretty and again you could easily make that into a Christmas card I mean you can take a little bit of the bottom off there and a slight amount from the edges just to make it a little bit smaller card without detracting too much um i would probably then put a little bit of green mirror card your shiny mirror card uh, in the background and that would really make this stand out on a card that would look super or in this case this will probably just go on my wall this christmas but uh, that's just another idea for it so let's have a look at these rooms. Green, green, green. Let's see where we start. Oh, we've got some stars at the end. Yay! So we're starting with our lovely clear crystals. And that's like a lemony, limey, greeny colour. And a lovely, oh, bright green there. And then a darker, rich green. And your blue. These are all just your standard size crystals. And then like a very pale champagne gold. And then we've got a larger green round. We've got some of your like um, pearls and they have got the iridescent coating on. So they sparkle different colours. And you've got some half sphere reds there. There's no facets on those. And then look at all those little stars. Aren't they cute? Little silver stars. Where are they going? Oh, they're number 13. So they are going to be dotted all over this dress all over this skirt so they're gonna look really pretty just sparkling away there in the clear crystal okay and then just a few more here this is number one two and three and we have an a b as well so we've got a lovely red there a lovely yellow gold and the white is actually a b coated which your a b is your aurora borealis which means, again, it's got that iridescent coating on and it's just going to sparkle a few different colours when you look at it. So, yay, that's really good. And, you know, there's no hot pink in this one, but it is uh, a Christmassy one. So it's all your golds and greens and reds. OK. Well, what a fab haul. I've really enjoyed looking at these. So, uh, very nice paintings. Okay, so we have had a lovely Christmas tree dress with lots of sparkle. We've had some great flip-flops. Yay, Christmassy flip-flops. Merry Christmas. And all those lovely drills come in baggies. And then just something a little bit different. We've got a grasshopper. Okay, three great print paintings all sent from DIYChews.com. So thank you ever so much DIYChoose.com for sending me these. I've uh, really enjoyed looking at them and they're really fun, uh, different products. Yay! There's lots more on the website as well. So if you do go and check them out and don't forget all the special offers. OK, well, if you've enjoyed looking at these with me, as always, a thumbs up is much appreciated. Uh, any comments or questions, if you leave them in the comments down below, and if you want to come back and see what we get up to next, then if you press the subscribe button and the all notifications bell next to it, you won't miss a thing. You'll be notified when any of my videos come up. So thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.